are you doing here today? So today I'm standing on Leighton High Street, I think, um, and we're in front of a small KFC out there with our two orangutans over. Um, and we have some placards here and some, some leaflets that we're handing out um, to the people that are passing as well as people that are going into the shop. Um, explaining to them that the packaging on the food that they are buying today is unfortunately sourced from um, scarce wood in the Indonesian rainforest. Thank you very much. Uh, they're claiming that the manager isn't there or that he's too busy to speak to us. Judging by the amount of customers they have, I sincerely doubt he's too busy to speak to us. But never mind. Thank you. really engaged in the issue and quite surprised that this is what KFC are doing. They're taking the leaflet and they say they'll go online and check out the web link. So that's really quite positive. Come out today, we've handed out leaflets, we've gone inside, we've tried to speak to the manager. We're getting great support from the public on cue. I think that they should speak to the outlets, that their local outlets that they engage with. I think that they should contact, they should contact their headquarters. I think they should get on the Greenpeace website and sign up to our revolting packaging um, campaign. So, if you care to check it out, go on the Greenpeace website and you'll find all the information you need. What should KFC do? They need to really look at their supply chain and get serious about taking ownership for the conduct of their company globally. It's not enough to try and source paper ethically in one country or one region. They need to have total ownership of their entire supply chain. KFC, message clear. Drop APP. Well, we're coming to the end of a very successful day now. We've been here for a few hours. We've handed out hundreds of leaflets. We've had some really good conversations with people. Our little friend here has proved to be quite a hit in Leighton High Street. And hopefully he'll be able to come back sometime because all his trees have not been cut down. Um, shall we go? Let's go. <laughs> Well, it's, it's difficult really to impress just how <laughs> hot it is in there, um, but I think it's worth it. Oh, you know, it's been a good day. <laughs>